About three years ago, I was asked by Apex Magazine to write a short story for them. The only request was that it be a riff off of an urban legend. So back then, that meant I could inject all of my own stuff into it, which means it was pretty irreverent, sort of pervy, and really darkly comic. And that story is called Seafoam, which is, that was that was the cover. So I should probably tell you what it's about, right? Jeremy, an infamous foot fetishist sentenced to a treatment group, falls off the wagon spectacularly when he meets Beverly. She is a beneather, one of an alien species living alongside us after rising from their hiding place at the depths of the ocean. Beverly has everything a man could want. She's funny, she's beautiful, she's got great feet. But does Beverly's reciprocation smack of a sinister and slimy secret? Will Jerry's probation officer revoke his freedom before he meets a bitter, sweaty end? And more importantly, did someone remember to bring donuts and coffee to the Sex Addicts Anonymous meeting? In this short tale of aliens, foot fetishism, and life choices gone horribly awry, I return to my roots, stirring up comedy and horror, muddling in a little sex, and serving it up ice cold. So if you're into adult short fiction that might be a little dirty, I'm not gonna lie, be a lot dirty. Seafoam is available now on Kindle for 99 cents. Also through the Amazon Prime program, you can get it through their free loan. So that's kind of cool. And don't worry if you don't have a Kindle. They have plenty of apps available for your phones, for your iPad, for your desktop computers, your laptop computers. You can read it pretty much anywhere. So yeah, check it out. I'd love for you guys to read it and add it on Goodreads. I'm gonna leave a whole bunch of links in the down bar and we'll just leave it at that. And that's it, that's, that's, that's the foam. If you have any questions about my decision to self-publish, feel free to ask that in the comment section. I, I really felt like it was the right decision, the right move at this point in terms of how publishing is going. So if you would like me to record a video about self-publishing and why I'm kind of moving in that direction, uh, leave a comment in the comment thread and I'll definitely take that into account and maybe I will film one. We'll see. Who knows? In the meantime, check out Seafoam. Thanks.